The regulator, by their inaction, surely is saying implicitly a vast bubble is actually an optimum market condition. Let's just keep going. So where does this end? Where do, where, you're, a, you're a practitioner, where does this end? And give us a date, and if okay. you're wrong, we'll hold you to it. Yeah, my understanding is there are a number of banks going through regulation now to set up. The regulator is more concerned that they have enough capital that when they do fall over, that actually that's fine. They're not actually caring about what is being done, what they're doing in their yeah. business plan. I think that's going to happen sooner rather than later, to, to, to be blunt. There's been lots of debates by, in the sector from traditional banks, ambulance societies, that the new entrants have had slightly easier rules to come in and whatever, they've got great business plans, maybe, maybe not. But actually, the, as long as they have enough capital to fail, that's fine. That seems to me a very naive way of looking at business because yeah, that has yeah. a massive impact on the whole of us doing business. It really does. You lose confidence in the system. I mean, I'm writing in a, in a book about trust about the concept that really you've got to trust the infrastructures that are around you. We've had that the last, since the crash anyway, people distrusting whatever. And I think that's going to get worse if, if yeah. that happens. I believe yeah. that.